bitch. Is it too much to ask for to see some motherfucking fist titties? I'm gonna go in here, I'm gonna close my eyes, be like peekaboo, titties. <laughs> Exotic Steel here, and today, wait, I'm not Exotic Steel anymore, I'm Surge Steel. So I have another video going up, it's gonna say Exotic Steel. I already have that thing recorded, so I'm sorry about that. But I am Surge Steel, I got kicked out of Exotic, blah blah blah, so sad, so traumatizing, whatever, you know. All because I wouldn't play a play game with G-Man, so he kicked me out of Exotic, so all of you who are sub to G-Man, I don't care if you stay sub to him, but he's just a moany little bitch, so yeah, but what happened here today was the big one, the Madden Ultimate Team Gauntlet last gameplay against the Oakland Raiders for better known as the Legends team. So, I'm going against a pretty good team. Golden Ticket Vic. I don't know, it's probably Ultimate Legend Vic. Ultimate Legend Vic, Bo Jackson, Jerry Rice, you know, all those good stuff. I mean, this was a tight game. It went down to the wire. I mean, you don't even understand how close this game was. I mean, it was weird. This game, I could stop their run. And there's two games in this whole series that I had a bunch of troubles with. It was the Seattle Seahawks and the Colts. Just the Seattle Seahawks, because in this, every pass teams would throw would normally be completed. So it was just really difficult with their crazy good run game to complete a pass, you know. They have the run game, Marshawn Lynch, and then they have Russell Wilson, so they abuse. And I'm pretty sure here, Vic ran it. No. He threw it out, blocked it, you know. Got this fourth down, which made me feel good. So, here's the punt by Kerr. He's gonna, he's gonna take a while to hike the ball, because he's a little fucking pansy. Whatever, so he hikes the ball. It's a pretty good kick. Pretty good, I mean very good. So I'ma let it go out, bounces out of the end zone. We're fine. So first touch on the field, Peyton Manning coming on. Peyton Manning knows what to do. First play we're gonna run the O1 trap. You know, get that good run in, maybe get a couple yards. With Frank Gore. So here's the run. I gained seven. But Frank Gore got popped on that one. So next play, I'm like, alright, I'll run it again. You know, running has been good. It hasn't made me fumble. But mistake, mistake here. I call hike and boom, I fumbled the ball. So Rodney, Rodney White gets that fumble recovery there. And they are in, they are already almost in the red zone. So what do we have to do? Can't allow that touchdown. So what ends up happening? First play, throw by Vic, gets out to about the 11 yard line. 14, same joke. Good catch there by Jerry Rice. I wanted to say Reggie White. <laughs> I don't know what I'm saying. So first down, handoff, runs it up for about four yards. Bo Jackson. So this game was tough. I was like, okay, I gotta play good. You know, gotta be able to do this. Next play, Michael Vick comes out, hikes it, and throws it deep. And Lambert, wait, sorry. Well, I thought this was a different play. I'm one play ahead of you because I'm thinking about what happened because this was traumatizing here. Third down and one. Michael Vick comes out with Bo Jackson behind him. I'm thinking, run. Right next to me, where I'm using, he gets that first. I was trying to bait it, but I was able to. So, first down. 
I'm gonna gamble that it's a run here. First down. Doesn't get the playoff. So we go into the second down. So here's the first play of the second quarter on our one yard line. Can we make a defensive stop? First play, Bo Jackson running, and he is stopped, ladies and gentlemen. Bo Jackson is stopped. Second and goal. What is Jay Gruden going to come up here? Come up with here? I don't see Shreed. I'm using with Shreed. Shreed goes up block, and it hits Walter Payton. Sweetness. Not able to get in the end zone. Third down and goal here. Can they? Can we stop them again? Yes, we can. Bo Jackson getting stopped by Shreed for a second time on that play, on that drive. Shreed coming up clutch there to not give up that touchdown. So here's the field goal. It's up and good. And here we are. The second drive of the game. Maybe we will not turn the ball over this time. So Deshaun Jackson in the end zone returning it and barely gets across the 10 to the 13 yard line. Now we have Peyton Manning's magic to work with. Running a little stick route, you know, normally leaves them open in these. So we see Larry Dunnell, we're like, all right, we got you. That ball should have been picked, hit him right in the chest. But hit Terrell Reeves right in the chest, so pretty lucky. Very next play, very, very next play. I can't talk. We're going to run it again. And we run that ball for about three yards. It's a fine run. You know, three yard gain. There. And we run spot corner. And these corner routes really killed this 99 overall legend team. As you can see here, Larry Donnell just comes out and is wide open for that corner route. Gain of about 18. Gets the 32. Very next play, we're running drive out. What can we do here? Pass out to Dwayne Bow. Is that Dwayne Bow? No, that was Matthews. Matthews catching it, two yards shy of the first down. Next play. We're going to run it again. Well, not again. Second time this drive. And what do we get? We get a gain of about two. And we're like, fine. Gain, give me a gain of two. I'll break. And then next play, Frank Gore on third and inches gets across. Diving so we wouldn't get killed. There, so it's 3 nothing still, Oakland. And at this point, I'm like, all right, so we're not fumbling on every drive. So all we have to do now is just get the lead before half time, then just kill the clock, right? But I see Matthews on this corner route, and he breaks a tackle racing down the sideline and gets to the 18-yard line. I'm like, oh shit, so I spike it. PA saddle to the tight end. What will we do here? We hike the ball. It's a play action pass. Corner route to Danell. Danell diving and does not get the touchdown. But very next play, first and goal on the one. We will be running with Frankie Gore. Frank Gore. Their Peyton Manning is going to call hike eventually. Oh, no. Nope. We're going to wait out the clock here. So, 19. 18. You know, just waiting out the clock. Because if we fumble here, this was my logic. We do not want them to have full time to get down the field and score on us. So, it's 7 sit. We're going to call it in about with 2 seconds left. And Frank Gore gets hit. Comes back. Falls backwards. And stumbling into the end zone, Frank Gore with the games. First touchdown, the extra point is good by Adam Benatari. So now this game goes from one, from three points to a four point game. From us losing to us in control of this game. 
And it's a pretty good kick, you know, pretty long and far. I'm sorry if you guys can hear this, I'm just trying to adjust to make myself more comfortable. I had to get a new chair, because the chair I had, its wheels fell off from one of the mountain games. I threw it on the ground because the kid was hacking, and EA wasn't doing shit. So, you know, so very next play after the kickoff, Michael Vick has sent a guy in motion. Vic takes the ball. Vic throws it out to, I believe that's Mike Ditka. I don't know. It's very hard to tell on this little screen in iMovie. But he picks up four. Next play. Vic. Outside. In the shotgun, I think. I don't know. He backs up. He backs up. He misses it. Deep. Chris Culliver getting that pick. And Chris Culliver making his presence known in this big game. Michael Vick threw it deep, and Culliver said, Oh, no, no, you don't. So next play is a little slant route. We were looking at Dwayne Bow, but he doesn't hold on to the ball. So we threw it to Crabtree, and Crabtree picks up nine. And now we're going into the no huddle offense, because after that, we're like, okay, we can score this. Next play is a play action pass. Manning. Faking it to Gore. And he sees Larry Donnell wide open. Larry Donnell beats one. And Larry Donnell brings the ball to the 34-yard line after a gain of 25. Next play. We will run that inside cross. And watch. I don't even know. I think that is John, whatever his name is. I can't remember. Oh, my God. I just had a brain fart. So we will pause it to put in Greg's leg zero one since it's a fifty one field goal fifty one yard field goal. We know that Venetary will not have the leg power for this. So Greg the leg coming in for this it was Matthews. Matthews caught it. And Greg the leg coming in for this fifty one yard field goal try. This will make it a one touchdown game. And will give us a huge advantage. Sorry guys, it wasn't 51 yards, it was 44 yards. So Venetary could have made it, but we want to make sure that we have enough leg in case lag kills us. And Greg the leg, pretty good shot right down into the back of the net. 10 to 3, us. And then here's the kickoff. We get the ball after half. And it has been a rough game so far. Just a lot of trying, scrappy plays. So the first play after the kickoff is here. We are going to be running the ball with Frank the Tank Gore. And let's see what Frank Gore can do here. First play after the kickoff, Frank Gore runs it. And he gets about a four-yard gain. Didn't fumble the ball, so we're good. Next, very next play. We will run it again with Frank the Tank. Peyton Manning coming out, and he snaps the ball. Frank the Tank gets an 8-yard gain, and at that point, that was the longest gain we've had in the day. So we're like, all right, last time we gained a yard, we fumbled the next play. So here we come out again with Frank the Tank, and we're running again. Frank the Tank runs this one for 9 yards. And we're like, our run game is getting better and better. So what do we do? We run again. First down and 10 on the 37. Gutsy call, four runs in a row. No, well, not four, six runs in a row. This will be the seventh. And, but we get a good gain of about four. Well, all right. That's not bad. Next play, second down and six. Frank Gore. See the safeties running it. Gains about three. So it's through down and about three here, I think. Yeah, third down and four, sorry. And we're like, we're not throwing it. Two balls in. We're going to run it again. So Frank Gore is about to run it. And then, of course, the video cuts off about here. So all you're going to see is Frank Gore getting tackled because we had to call that timeout because the play was about to end. But all you're going to see here 
is me about to call the play and then Frank Gore get tackled. You guys will see Frank Gore getting tackled. He got popped. Luckily, it didn't go for a loss of yards. So Frank the Tank here, and you see he got tackled. Only got a gain of one. Fourth down and three. We will punt the ball. I'm not taking any risks here. And we will see if we can get a good punt here. Pretty decent power. And a pretty good punt. Puts him at his 11-yard line. But look at this return. Returns it to about the 35. He gets it at the 34-yard line now. With 40 seconds left in the third quarter, it's looking like he might be able to come back, or the computer, I don't know if it's a he or she, might be able to come back and beat us. So what happens here? First play after the snap, Michael Vick taking off, gains six yards there. Michael Vick putting in work today. We have Lambert. We're using with Lambert, picking our play. Seven seconds left on the clock. Last play of the drive, and it's a run with Dwayne Bow. Bo Jackson. Dwayne Bow is on my team. Run with Bo Jackson. They get a first down, so that's fine. First down, it was either going to be that or a frustrating third down and two. So now that it's they got that first down, here's the pass. Run with Bo Jackson, and Bo Jackson gets about five or six yards. And Bo, second down and five now. What will happen? Using with Lambert again. We're going to be watching the tight end. And the tight end blows by us. And we miss a tackle. Now they're at their 24, three yard line. And this is looking bad, guys. They are in about four down territory. And I can't stop them. So what ends up happening? First play, Michael Vick takes it. Going back, going back, going back. Gets hit, stays still on his feet. Going back some more. And he gets hit again for a loss of 24. Greg Hardy never giving up. Hits Vick. Vick knocks him down and comes back and takes him out. Very next play, second down and 24 on the 37-yard line. Here's the play. It's a run. This run gains about seven. So now it's third down and 17. They are in field goal range. The only way to get them out of it would be with a sack. So what happens now? We're using with Lambert again. We have Lambert covering his man perfectly. Bo running out. And who gets the sack? No other than Greg Hardy coming up clutch. They are, have a 55-yard field goal on the way. With a 99 kicker, this kick should be easy. But who knows? He could mess up. The computer messes up all the time. Here's a kick. And it's botched. Wide right. The kick is no good. And we are now almost able to kill the clock. We just need one first down. Can we get the first? We run the ball. We get a gain of about four. They call their first time out. Second down and six now. Running the same play. A minute 50 left in this game. Sh they should not be able to come back. It's three to ten, so they need a touchdown to win this, to tie this game, and then P and an extra point to win. And a two-point conversion to win. So third down and five. We are running the stick route again. And you are going to watch the slant pattern. No one. We got to throw the triangle. And Peyton Manning got hit as he was throwing. And the ball. And he couldn't get the ball out in time. So now we have to go to Andrew Lee again for this punt. And we are going to get that full power on it. A great punt, and it gets out of bounds at their five yard, six yard line. So they need 94 yards and a minute and 37 seconds left. I know they're not this good. 
So, what happens now? Put 30 seconds left on the play clock. Michael Vick will snap the ball. They're sending his man in motion. And watch Bo Jackson on that little wheel route. That, that wasn't Bo Jackson. Oh my god, I'm still up a play. Sorry guys, still up a play. Watch Bo Jackson here. They throw it, but Bo Jackson stepping out of bounds. Giving us the advantage. Now with a minute 21 left. Third down and seven. What can Michael Vick do? Michael Vick looking, 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 throwing. And that is a catch by Jerry Rice. Now the clock's still winding down. They're going no huddle. Michael Vick gets to the line and is trying to quick snap it. Here's the pass. It's thrown deep. And intercepted. Patrick Lorian making his name. And we will be able to kneel this game out. I will see you guys when I see you guys. Peace.